for my bomb thing is today. Now today we're doing an unboxing of the 2012 edition of the Apple TV. This does look exactly the same as the 2011 edition. It's mainly the software that's been changed, uh, but I'll get into that in the review. Um, so this is an Australian version, so the plug will be different to what I normally use. So I will have to buy some sort of adapter, of course. Um, but the price there is a big price difference. Um, if you're wondering, um, in the UK this costs 99 pounds. In the in Australia it's 109 dollars, which works out to 66 pounds. So it's a third off, pretty much. So it's quite a big price difference. Um, so obviously I've taken the tape off now, and we'll get into the box. So you simply slide the cover off, and you've got the Apple TV right here in front of you. Put that to one side for now. It's quite small. You also get the remote as well as your Australian plug which I'll buy an adapter for later on and a setup guide and that's about it. Um, so on the back on this thing you've you haven't really got much on there. You've um take the plastic off the Apple TV. Sort of tape covering everything. So the ports you do get, you get a Ethernet. Optical audio, HDMI, USB, and obviously the power cord, and that's pretty much it. It's about the size of your hand, um, obviously because it's in the size of your hand, but that's that's pretty much it. And that's the remote next to it with a sort of D-pad, menu, play and pause button, and a select button, and that's all that's on the remote. Um, so yeah, that's just my really really quick unboxing of the Apple TV. Um, stay subscribed if you want to see the review um, with the new software in there, um, the 2012 version and everything else so yeah thanks for watching